Hello everyone, this is Yanis Batura and in this video I'm going to show how to align parallel texts in a Glona reader. For this purpose I have prepared a Christmas Carol by Charles Dickens in English and German. Let's open the program and create a new book. The newly created book is empty and we need to import some text to start aligning. That is done by selecting Pair, Import. Here we have to specify two files. The first by convention is the original language of the book, English in our case, and the second is its translation. You can adjust the width proportion by dragging the border between the columns Also, you can reverse the left and right text by selecting Book, Reverse or pressing Ctrl-R. Before aligning, let's fill in some basic info about the book. To save the book, select File, Save. The file name should begin with the language pair code ENDE, then the surname of the author, a hyphen, and the title. Now, if we close the program and open it again, the file we worked with last time is automatically restored. Aligning in a Glona reader is manual and consists in consecutive separation of corresponding fragments or pairs from the remaining non-aligned text. You can separate the next pair using the mouse by clicking the last words of the pair. To undo an incorrect separation, press Z or Ctrl up or click and drag the white pair up. The dashed frames that are always shown in the white text are used for separating pairs with the keyboard. If you press space or click the right mouse button, the dashed frame pair will be separated. To adjust the left frame, press Ctrl, right or left. To adjust the right frame, press Alt, right or left. To adjust both frames simultaneously, simply press right or left. To adjust the left frame on per word basis, press Ctrl, Shift, right or left. To adjust the right frame on per word basis, press Alt, Shift, right or left. Adjusting both frames simultaneously can also be done with the mouse by horizontal dragging. Double clicking a word instantly separates a pair using the dashed frame on the other side. To navigate through the aligned text, press up or down or scroll the mouse wheel. You can also simply click a pair to select it. To edit a separated pair, navigate to it and press F2. Note that the, in the current version of a Glona reader there is no possibility to edit non-aligned pairs and if you press F2 on such pairs instead of the edit pair window, a little red circle appears in the top right corner. F2. 
This circle indicates that after you have separated the next pair, it will instantly appear in the edit pair window. The F2 window is also used for marking certain pairs as items in the book structure. Let's correct the first pair so it sits in one line and mark it as level 1. All other chapters in this book also must be marked with level 1. To check the book structure, select the appropriate command in the menu. In the bottom of the window, there is a status bar, which shows the number of the current pair, the total number of pairs, the percentage in the terms of volume, the current speed of aligning in fragments per hour, the percent of the book that was aligned since the stopwatch began ticking, and the estimated time remaining to align the rest of the book with the current speed. You can pause and unpause the stopwatch by pressing F5 and reset it with Ctrl F5. One last thing to know is how to copy some text to clipboard. To do this, switch to the reading mode by pressing Tab, then hold Ctrl and select the text you need, then press Ctrl C. The text has now been copied to clipboard. Let's paste it somewhere. When aligning, never forget to save your progress from time to time with Ctrl S. Now you know everything to quickly and easily align parallel books. Thanks for watching and have fun aligning!